Hi everybody, it's me, Curry T, and in this video I'm going to be talking about a little phrase that you can use to help ground you if you're triggered, if you're anxious, if things just feel like they're all going wrong and you're looking at something and you're thinking, oh my god, what the hell am I going to do? And you can't see a way out of it and you don't know how it's going to unfold and all of that kind of stuff. It's just a really short little phrase that I used to use and it started when I was in Australia and I still use it. I used to use it and I still use it. But when I was in Australia um, and I worked in a corporate office as a social media specialist and things would go wrong and nobody would know what to do. And everybody used to laugh at me because it sounded really English when I said this. But I always used to say, well, it is what it is and we are where we are. <laughs> and the thing is that it's a really simple phrase that used to kind of ground everyone and go, yeah, it is what it is and we are where we are and now we're just going to take one step at a time until it unfolds naturally. We'll figure out what to do but right now it is what it is and we are where we are. So by doing this, by saying this little phrase, we're not accepting that things are just the way they are and that's it and that's the final destination. We're not doing that. We're just saying that right now in this moment, it's okay for us to accept that things are the way they are. And then if you add on the phrase, things change, one of my favorites, things change, you know that you're moving forward. So before we can move forward, we have to accept what is. It's okay for us to do two things simultaneously and for us to feel two things simultaneously. So to accept the present, to accept that we're unhappy, dissatisfied, disappointed, sad, heartbroken, anxious, whatever it is, for us to accept that that is currently what is. But also at the same time for us to know what our desire is for change and for us to know that things do change. It's okay for us to do those two things at once. You see, so if we accept what is knowing that things change and we put those two things together, it is what it is, we are where we are, and things change. You can use this for literally any scenario, any scenario at all, whether it's something that's gone wrong at work or something that's gone wrong in a relationship or you've said something or done something, you think, oh no, why did I do that? It is what it is and we are where we are <laughs> right now. And from there, we, get, we let go of all the chaos. We let go of all the chaos of what went wrong and how it happened and we come back to the moment we say, right, it is what it is and we are where we are. And then from there, we move forward to things change and things are changing. Things are always changing, like right now. That's the only thing that we have, the fact that things change. And for me, this just gives me lots of peace. It just helps ground me in the moment. And from there, I can make a decision. I can move forward. I can ask for help. I can talk to someone. Something happens. Something always happens. Something always changes. But right now, it is what it is. And we are where we are. <laughs> and if you can say it in a very English accent, I think it's more fun, actually. So let me know how you can use this today and how you feel about this little phrase. And if you do find that you use it after watching this video, come back to the video and let me know how this phrase helped you. I would love to know. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.